We don't have to go back too far for this one this afternoon. From the Loch Ness Monster to the Bermuda Triangle, there are mysterious things all around us that are yet to be explained, including a parking lot in Auburn that has its own mystery. Sam Rogers reports. I don't know what possesses them to hit it. I don't know how they keep hitting it. It's never a dull moment. And it just kept kind of kind of ha happening and happening and happening. Everyone's hitting the Walmart pole is what it seems like. The curse of the Auburn Walmart pole is puzzling. What did the good people of Central Maine do to deserve this? Something must have gone down. <laughs> Something's attracting all that energy. I don't know. Something's going on. I don't I don't know, man. If you find out, let me know. I'd love to know. Auburn will be known by us as <laughs> the Walmart pole town. <laughs> Jason Alexander had his first close encounter with the pole kind in 2020. Are there and everything, but it's Walmart. So you just kind of put it out of your mind, go do your thing. He wasn't alone. The Facebook group, the Auburn Walmart Pole Strikes Again, has almost 1,000 members. Now I have people from Missouri joining my group. It's a pole community. Founder Jaden Xavier Smith worked at the Walmart four years ago and it used to get hit back then too. And it's pretty easy to get lost in this virtual rabbit pole with memes and photos posted every day. There's even stickers and shirts dedicated to this sinister symbol that has literally taken cars off the road. Jake Sear knows because they come to his auto shop. It's a parking lot, you're going what, 15, right. 20 miles an hour? You wouldn't think it would cause that much damage, but no, we've definitely seen some nasty ones come through. For a big story like this, we wanted to hear from all sides. So we came to the infamous spot to ask the poll some hard hitting questions. First, what's your deal? Why do cars constantly drive into you? Dodging the question. Credit to these shoppers, they're still taking their chance, even helping heal the poll back to full strength. But on Facebook, it's a way for Mainers to escape. It never trails off into some other discussion. We're just here to have a laugh about the pole. I just want my group to be a fun little place where we can all come together and laugh at something. But for now, it's the poll that has the last laugh. In Auburn, Sam Rogers, New Center, Maine.